Hey guys, quick little intro. DC had a really bad sinus infection. I believe it's called sinitis. I might be pronouncing that wrong. Don't hold me to it. Anyways, basically like the duct work in your nose and like the nasal cavity and stuff was so full and infected that like snot was literally draining out of his eyeballs. It was nuts. Like I've never seen anything like that in my life. So I'm gonna insert some pictures here. <laughs> There's a war going on outside, no one is safe from the notice. And yeah, I felt really bad for him. He couldn't drive, he couldn't watch TV, he couldn't even like read text messages on his phone. And when he was trying to, his phone was like this close to his face. I felt so bad for that guy. And that was like four or five days of that before like the medicine kicked in and he started to feel better. So he is, he's okay now. He's back to work. He's feeling better. But... You know, hopefully when he feels a little bit more better and gets more back in the swing of things that we can get back on track for Juggalo Talk. We've got some good topics. We're just kind of waiting for him to feel better. So, back to the video. Hey, yo. Hello. We were going to do, I wanted to do a live stream lunch with Megs in DC like we used to do. But he's not filling up for live stream. He's sicky. <coughs> I am. And don't mind the camera, like... You guys are tilted. It's because of what you're sitting on, and I can show you here in a minute. But <laughs> you, if you've seen it, you would understand. So we went to Arby's because I wanted to get a ham and cheese sandwich. I've been craving it for literally six months. On the truly. But apparently they got rid of their ham. Yeah, which is crazy. Oh, I'm sorry. What? They just don't have ham anymore then because it really wasn't out of our way I went to Hardee's Yay. and we're gonna try this because I can't have bread and I've been craving a ham and cheese sandwich like I said for like six months hey, save your small bag for these mm, okay and then I was trash. like wait a minute why don't I just ask for a ham and cheese sandwich without the bun She was so sweet. Like, she even gave me, like, utensils. So, yeah. we're going to try it. See if it tastes as good as I remember it tasting. Well, see, and technically, I got a new food item, too. Really? Yeah, you got to show us off. Okay, Arby's. Okay. Arby's apparently has... Huh. That's, like, a perfect amount, too. Yeah. Arby's apparently has this chicken bacon ranch loaded fries you might have to stick up a little bit for people to hear you and really that soft. sounds great so dc has mm. cyanitis what was it how did she say it again sinusitis sinusitis something like that so he literally has boogers coming out of his eyeballs like it's so backed up these glands here that it's literally leaking out of his eyeballs it's nuts so he can't see. So he can't drive, so he can't go to work. Mmm. They're so good. Is it good? Not only is it like so juicy, but it's got like cheese on it. This shit's good right here. This is the bomb daily. Mm mm. Mm hmm. I'm getting this all the time now. It's so hard to find like fast food options that are gluten-free and really the only one that we found is Wendy's but I'm getting like so sick of Wendy's because every time we go out to eat for like a get-together or we go out of town or something we go to Wendy's like you get burnt out going to only one fast food place because Wendy's fries are gluten-free and their taco salad is gluten free and it comes with like salsa and corn tortilla chips. And they have apple bites and strawberries and stuff too. Yeah. Mmm, this is so good. Look I'm at all, that. I'm all out of drink. Look at that juicy cheese. Mm -hmm. Very nice.
I got their fries to try too at Hardee's because apparently they are gluten free but they may be fried in the same oil as like other things like onion rings and that's how Burger King's is like they fry their onion rings and everything probably their chicken fries all in the same thing I could literally eat like three french fries from Burger King and instantly get sick because of the cam contamination that's crazy So I'm, I'm curious, like, how hardy is this going to be? We don't know to try. I've never had any issues with Wendy's, so, though. So. Bro, this is really good. It's good. Yeah. It's hard to find any kind of, um, like, protein or meat option fast food because everything's breaded. Right. I should have got a different drink. That's really good. If you need to use my water, you can. Where's it at? I can hand it to you. <laughs> Where'd you put it? Perfect. Thank you. So. Let's just trade these out. We are saving up for Hollow Wicked. Super excited about that. Super excited for that. And we are going to try to go to Shaggy's tour. Try. I haven't bought tickets or anything. We're just going to see what finances look like when that time comes. Yeah, it's in like two weeks. I know. Playing baseball at the park. Playing Pokemon. You know, adult I would, stuff. Yeah. We're just like at the park watching other people's kids play. Like, nothing weird about that. But so the thing about the Shaggy 2 Dope tour is if we just went. And like didn't spend the night we could probably afford it and be fine but it's that hotel cost that has me like mm, do i really want to pay a hundred bucks extra just to go to this tour because you know if we buy tickets ourselves and they're like what 30 each i think so yeah then we, we pay 60 bucks but if we have to pay 120 or 140 that's 60 for the hotel that 60 bucks then turns into like 200. it's a big difference I don't know, for me, I guess, I'm willing to miss it because we're going to Hollow Wicked. Yeah. I think about, like, <clears throat> gatherings in July. Then go see Shaggy in August. And then October, we go see Hollow Wicked. Mm -hmm. Oh. And Fright Fest. And we're seeing Twisted. Twizzlers. It's just weird for me to think about that because normally I wouldn't be able to get that much time off, but I'm like, I'm going to put my two weeks notice in today. Like, I have it typed up. I just haven't emailed it yet. <laughs> I don't know why I'm like so hesitant. But like, once it's done, it's done, you know? Right. Would somebody ask, like, and I have it written down on my video suggestions uh, to make a video where we kind of like talk about our like day jobs. Like they asked what our day jobs were, but I thought we could make a video telling like all of our day jobs, like everywhere we've worked. Everywhere we've ever worked. Mm-hmm. That'd be a fun video. Every job we've ever owned. Yeah. <laughs>